Good morning, guys. <laughs> Good morning, tribe. I am so exhausted. Yo, so exhausted, guys. It's almost 7 a.m. and I'm still in bed. I'm still so tired. Um, I had a very short sleep. I slept very late last night. So that is why I am so tired. I was working the whole evening. And, and I had to take sleeping meds just to to get my sleep first because i was very tired you i was tired yesterday was uh was suffering so besides going to work yesterday i had tenants moving in during the day while i was at work so at my lunch at my lunch hour i had to come to my place and and welcome the students and help them move in and locate their keys and and do all that that wara wara you know i did all that and then i went back to work work was not hectic but you know you gotta gotta show up <laughs> i did that um so my lunch hour was just so hectic the driving the moving in of the tenants and the driving back and work it was bad guys it was bad it was so bad that i had to you yeah, i know i had to i had to find a way to get energy still for after work for me to be able to prepare a room for a client that had already moved in but their room was not ready it was furniture everywhere it was dirty and we had uh just installed um what are those things security uh don't the first year yeah security backlash english <laughs> so it was so dirty everything was everywhere the tiles have that those droplets of the of the machine yay it was chaos i had to clean that up i had to so it was that bad and let me tell you one thing i don't talk at five and then there was load sharing at six so i had one hour i had one hour to do all of that you should have seen me guys a mad woman didn't look like me, you know. Mad woman under under in under an understatement. I was a chicken. I was here, there, carrying a heater, carrying a headboard. All on my own. On my own. <laughs> I am strong. After yesterday, I am strong. I had one hour literally because there's gonna be load shedding and it's really dark when there's load shedding in the house it's really really dark so i had to make sure that when load shedding starts i am done in that room done it was that bad i moved everything by six um, when load shedding started i wasn't done but i took my uh i used a lamp i used a lamp to light the room so i worked for a few minutes then sharp i stored everything where it was supposed to be stored now i had to make means to cook because now the shooting was gonna be back at eight and eight is very late i don't have i don't have um alternative means to cook i only have electricity which reminds me i need to buy a gas stove yes so this month i'm buying myself a gas stove because now i had to wait for eight to be able to cook then when load shedding came back at 8, I only started cooking then. And I finished at 10. I don't know why I didn't just cook up and eat. Oh, oh, suffering, guys, last night. At 10. So I only had my supper at 10. Ne? Then I remembered that my laptop is... Uh, I need to fix something. 
on my laptop so i have this guy who helps me with the laptop so we work remotely so i hit up this guy i'm like dude i'm free can we please uh do this laptop because now i can't i can't work i can't i don't like reading my emails on the phone so i need to have this laptop fixed sharp the guy is like cool i'm game let's connect did i not suffer even more because now i'm tired i'm sleepy my feet are killing me and now this laptop didn't want to connect the version is old i don't know the password i had to restart oh. i was like no ways no ways so i'm telling this guy no this is not working and he's like nah let's do it tomorrow so he's gonna come over today and check out my laptop and check out what's wrong with it and i'm still not gonna have a laptop the whole day sharp so here i am today about to wake up now and hit uh my nine to five. Oh. By the way, this is my last day. I'm going on leave. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. It's first leave. So I haven't been taking leave at work for a long time. So now I have excess leave. So they were like, no girl. We're taking you on first leave. Please don't come to work. <laughs> Yo, guys, I was working in December. When everyone was having the time of their lives, I was working. But it's fine. So now they put me on forced leave. So I'm just going to take a few days off and relax. Just going to relax. Yeah, I know I'm not going to relax, but it's fine. I'll try to. So now let me just wake up and get ready for, for my last day. Yay. I'm just going to take a shower now and then get ready I will see you guys in a bit. I love you. <sighs> Welcome back, guys. So I'm at work. So I'm just just at the mall now. Ooh. Just wanna come and ask for boxes at the store. Hello. I'm just here to ask for boxes that you guys don't use. You don't have. What about the ones you unpacking today? Can I get them tomorrow? What time tomorrow can I come? Early, early around this time. Thank you. Okay. So yeah, I was asking for boxes. I am sorting out some. I have a lot of things, so I just want to store them nicely in a, in boxes and then so yeah I'll get the box tomorrow. Let me get myself some coffee. Some coffee. I'm craving a cappuccino. So bad, Thank you. 
Got my coffee. Oh, Valentine's. I just had a thought now about Valentine's. Uh, most people would say that they don't believe in Valentine's. But what is the real reason behind that? Behind that logic? Why don't you believe in Valentine's Day? Is it because you've been disappointed too many times? Don't come with the who is Valentine? Why are we celebrating love on one day? Why are we celebrating your birthday on one day, in one day, on that specific day? So let Valentine's be Valentine's. The 14th of February is about love. Don't come with the theories and like, be all, nah, 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 I don't believe in Valentine's. You should show love every day. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. I was saying, please don't come with your theories that... Um, why do we only celebrate Valentine's Day? Woo! On the 14th, we should show love every day. Why do we celebrate Freedom Day on the 27th? Because that's a significant day. 14th is also a significant day, guys. Please don't. I know we've all been disappointed. We've all gone through the heartbreaks. And some people don't get gifts on Valentine's Day, which is fine. You can just tell your partner that you love them, that you appreciate them, send them a nice message. You don't have to buy all these expensive things. You don't have to buy flowers or anything. You don't have to buy, guys. Just show appreciation on the 14th. I know we love them every day and appreciate them every day, but on the 14th, do that. Hi guys, I am at Woolies. <coughs> I had this a sale, so I'm just just coming to view a few things. I need a few things for my baby, so I'm just gonna see if I get anything. I love Woolies. Ooh, sixty-five percent off. Sure. Sixty-five percent off. That's good. Let me shop around and see. Good afternoon, guys. <laughs> it is raining in Bloemfontein. It is raining bad. You and your girl doesn't have an umbrella. But thank goodness to car guards, those guys are heavenly sent, heavenly sent. So this guy escorted me with an umbrella and helped with my trolley. So I didn't get a drop of rain. So I'm officially, guys, on leave. I'm she Yay, Jonga. Dise leave ni. Ntati leave. Ntati leave. I'm officially on leave guys i am going to sleep the weather permits i'm going to drink coffee i'm going to sleep i'm going to binge watch youtube i'm going to binge sleep i'm going to binge everything social media everything <laughs> hi guys so i'll come back um so i just got home and it was load sharing but i think it was loading, but now the electricity is back. I just had to wait 15 minutes before the electricity came back. So I'm just going to show you now, guys, what I bought today. Uh, wow. Got myself some spinach. Because the weather. <laughs> and some coffee. And some rust, but no rust. 
They taste really nice. I got all of these from Shakers. So I got myself this, this cabbage. I'm gonna cook this namatambo, guys. Namatambo. Let me show you. When I got pork trotter. Oh, I love this. Mm. Get these at Checkers. They're very cheap. Very, very cheap. But this for 22 rands. It's meaty bones. Mix them or cook them with cabbage. Ah, heaven. Heaven. Okay, then I've got myself some fruit. I've already opened them as we can. Then I have this. I love peanut butter with brown bread. Heaven. Then I got cheese. Yeah. Oh, and then I got these at Woolies. Wow. What? Got this for my baby. They're on sale. Yeah, they're on sale. Got them for 59 rands. I'd really uh, uh, mm, 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 mm. So cute. So, so cute. <sighs> so, I'm going to do now. I'm going to go take a shower and grab a cup of coffee before I hit the bed and relax. So, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching my vlogs. Thank you for subscribing. Please keep on subscribing. Tell everyone to subscribe. I love you. Mwah.